But yeah, let's go ahead and get into the stories here. All right. We got some fun little stories. And we start off with a beast of a story. Yeah. Yeah. So, as we alluded to in Raw, we had two references to Brock Lesnar. One was done by Seth Rollins, mentioning that he's slayed a beast before. That's a reference to Brock Lesnar. And then we had one from Cody Rhodes. He said basically the same thing. He's beat a beast. (laughs) So... With two references to Brock Lesnar, it got the community talking. Is Brock Lesnar possibly coming back? It got so far to where we actually had the journalist, and I put that in quotes, they reached out to WWE and they found that Brock Lesnar is not indeed coming back or is not planned. Of course, that can change. I initially thought, well, not initially. I got a thought that maybe what the WWE was doing was they put the feelers out there, not to necessarily, you know, test the waters, but to more so like maybe go ahead and get the uproar out of the way before they actually bring him back. Does that make sense? Yeah. Just kind of see what happens. Like, oh, Rock's car back. So, ah, yeah, because they know. Yeah, because they know back and they're all tired. Fans are going to be pissed. Yeah. So go ahead and do it, and then. I don't know. It's like when you have a spouse and you like, let me go ahead and tell you now before you get home. So, <laughs> right. So you can get your pissed out of the way. I can see that. I could just see if the reaction wasn't that bad now. Like, okay, now it's time to bring Brock. Yeah. And if I'm being honest, I've pretty much said this. I've been pretty much been consistent with this. Brock Lesnar. So why is he off TV? I'm sure everybody knows, but if you don't know, Brock Lesnar was. Not even named in the Janelle Grant's Vince McMahon case. He was alluded to. Weirdly enough, they named him in the Netflix documentary. But in the actual document, he was never named. It just said a former UFC fighter and champion. Uh, obviously, you know who that is. But <laughs> it could have been Cain Velasquez. Yeah, see? Yeah. Could have been Ronda Rousey. Could have been Ronda Rousey. Oh, shit. We just blew it open. Yeah, but yeah, he was never named. And if he was named, this shows me people didn't read the document. Because just because his name is in there, that's why they're canceling him. But in the document, it said he tried to set up a play date. And the extent of it was him looking at a pee video. (laughs) He never met her. Mm -hmm. They tried once. Something happened. They tried again. Something happened. So he never (laughs) met her. Was the intent there? Okay. They made arrangements for him to tear her in half. Yeah. Only arrangements. Like, we're getting canceled off arrangements now. You can't even set it up. Can you imagine? Like, all right, uh, Wednesday, 5 o'clock on the 18th, I'm going to shut on your face. Okay, let me just put that on my planner. Yeah. I did hear a lot of people like, okay, well, she was still getting essentially pimped out by (laughs) Vince. He never met her, but, you know, she was getting pimped. And then on the other hand, people were like, oh, I don't think it was Vince pimping her out. I think it was just more him being a boy. Oh, I got this girl. Mm-hmm. <laughs> she lost me shit on her. You want some of this? <laughs> You'd be perfect for her. I don't know. I've been pretty consistent where I don't have too much sympathy for the, the lady getting paid millions of dollars. Yeah, there is that. Definitely we're in this position because Vince didn't want to pay her. It's not like she was handcuffed and kept in a cage. She had every opportunity to walk away from what it sounds like. She decided to stay. So that to me is not a victim. That's a participant. True. And essentially she she was an escort. But I think through all this, I don't know, it's time to uncancel Brock and let him back into the WWE. Let him do his little money matches that he has left and then right off into the sunset. And Triple H has said as such in multiple scrums. Oh, it's just Brock being Brock, you know. He's just not here because he's not here. Mm-hmm. <laughs> like, when he wants to come back, he's got a door open or whatever. Hopefully sooner than later. Oh, Brock Lesnar versus Jacob Fatu. Beast versus Werewolf. Now that's a hard-hitting match right there. Oh, But yeah, let us know what you think. Do you think Brock Lesnar deserves a comeback? 
or should he stay canceled? Let's know what you think in the comments below. Wonder where that's going to go. 